right, so um, I wanted to show you all this. I got a uh, Queen made blank tea from the Forest Witch. <clears throat> so I wanted to do a bit of an unboxing. Um, it's black tea, orange pieces, elderberries, rose hips, etc., etc. Uh, I'd ordered this from the Forest Witch before and really enjoyed it. So I thought I would. Uh, the first one I'd ordered was a sample, so I thought I would get a fuller bag. And you can see this is what it looks like. Um, and she sent a nice little note with it. Many happy sips, etc. It's got this neat little, I don't know, organic um, hemp string that, tie, that she ties to it. I really liked it. I thought it was kind of cool. Anyway, uh, and since as you can see, I already opened it for my morning tea. I made a cup and was going to taste it to see if it tasted the same. And it does. It's very orangey. Kind of have, has a little bit of a hibiscus flavor to it. Kind of honey-like. If you have ever tr eaten a hibiscus. I used to, when I was a kid, <laughs> pull them off my mom's branches, uh, bushes all the time and just nibble on them because they were sweet. Um, I don't know if I would advise kids doing that now because who knows what kind of inorganic stuff gets sprayed on them. But anyway, it's just kind of a nostalgic thing. So I gave it a try. Uh, and I really like the flavor. It's very, um, it has almost an orange flavor to it, which I think has to do with <clears throat> of course the orange but I also taste the honey from the hibiscus and I'm, I'm not really sure about the taste of the other lavender is kind of light in it and the rose hips is just a hint here and there of the different flavors depending on how many sips you take but anyway I enjoyed it so if you like uh, flavored teas and organic teas and especially if you're like me interested in Celtic stuff she has this uh, Maeve tea blend on her website and I'll put a link in my down bar. Uh, thanks Mia for sending it to me. I'm looking forward to enjoying many more mornings with it. Um, I had to go to a better light to show you what the tea looks like but it's black tea and you can see some of the other ingredients in there. I don't know if you can really see the Yeah, there we go. Corn flour. The blue is the corn flour. I'm guessing the pink is the hibiscus. Anyway, so that's what the tea looks like. And it comes in this little package. And uh, it smells really wonderful. I can smell the hibiscus from here. Anyway, so thanks Mia. I hope you've enjoyed this short little video. Bye.